here, so who's got a question for Annie? Annie, what did that mean to you to get to get onto the team, especially given the way this week's played out, not getting on the team in the 200 breast? Yeah, um, I just kind of woke up this morning, like, super at peace. Like, the 200 obviously did not go my way. Um, 221's on a bad swim. No. It's just wasn't good enough on Wednesday, and that I was pissed about it. I, I will not lie to you. I was really pissed, but um, that's the competitor in me. I don't think it would be right for me to be in the sport if I wasn't upset. But I just woke up this morning and I was like, I think I'm gonna get second in the hundred breast today. Like I literally said that to my mom. I was like, I don't know. I just I had no reason to feel that way. Like swimming against Lydia and and Lily, I literally didn't. But I I don't know. I just. I just felt better about today than I did in the 200. I feel like the 200, I just was swimming with all this like pressure mm -hmm. of like needing to do what I had to do last summer and reclaim my spot, whatever. And today I just didn't feel that way. I just felt like I was swimming more free. Is there anything that's clicked for you or that you've worked on with your developing emotional maturity and calmness as you approach meets, perhaps over the last year and a half? Uh, well, life has thrown me some curveballs over the last year and a half or two years, I would say, as it has with anyone, but um, I was trying not to like be like, why me on Wednesday and Thursday after the 200, but um, you know, trying not to be like, is it just me or do I feel like I just have really bad luck sometimes? And Ray also said the same thing later in the day. He's like, I've never met a more resilient swimmer, but I've never had a more snake-bitten swimmer ever in my entire 30 years of coaching. So, like, it made me feel a little bit better, but also, like, just the curveballs that life has thrown at me um, have just kind of made me to be emotionally resilient and to be able to kind of compartmentalize, you know, parts of things. And I think last year at trials, I had the exact same experience I did on Wednesday. So I'm the third fastest time in the world, but I got third. And that didn't mean I wasn't going to make the team. It just meant I had to refocus and regroup. And I had the same exact situation this year. I had one day off in between to refocus and just had a, you know, had, got my hand on the wall second today, and that's all that really matters, I guess. Has anything changed for you this? Did you, coming off of the Olympics, um, were, you, were you still in kind of the same place of like, I still want to keep swimming for this reason, or um, did something shift for you after those Olympics and this year? Uh, I yes and no. I I definitely am still a competitor through and through, and I want to win, and you know that's why we're all here, right? But. Um, I just now feel like I don't have to like prove anything to anyone. Um, I'm super content with how my career has gone thus far and um, now I can just swim because like I want to go fast and I, I just want to be at the highest level and I want to swim for as long as I'm happy swimming and um, I think I kind of lost sight of that on Wednesday um, and today I don't feel like that is how I felt at all. I definitely feel like I went back to kind of my normal, my normal self today so yeah. That moment with Lily at the end obviously looked really special. She, or you held her hand up just like she held yours up last year. Um, what has it been been like with her the past couple of days? How has she helped pick you up and refocus for this event? Yeah, I definitely think Lily knows her lane in which how to help. Um, and I think for me, um, you know, she consoled me right after the race in the 200. She's like, it's okay, it'll be all right. Like, you know, really quickly, but also like, for her, like, a really important thing for me and our friendship for her is she's just consistent. Like, I know what I'm going to get with her, and I know that she is going to treat me the exact same no matter how I swim.